Hey, how's it going? This is Zachary Yutubski, and right before you see two homemade rails. They are so cool. So, first of all, this is the first one I made. It is really, whoa, it's, it's a really good rail, it's just that, like, it was really hard to make. See, because I needed to cut up a piece of wood here. Then I need to cut another one just about half a, half the size of this. I had to screw it on here, put this rail on, screw it on, make it go down, put a sticker on, spray paint it, and blah, 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 all that ball. Anyways, so next we have this, and this is my second rail. It's a little bit different. You can see it's an arch. It's like a rainbow rail, but not quite. And this time I didn't spray paint it. I just added a little monster logo thing whatever onto it and yeah I'll show you how they work so first of all um this is like my, I, I don't really have a name for it like maybe you guys can like subscribe and please leave me a comment on what should I name this ramp like something just whatever anyway so this is how it works so you just jump up to it and slide down, yeah. But what I find on it is when you go on your trucks, like a 50-50 grind, it's much harder than this rail, for it is much, like, coarser uh, metal, like steel. It's really coarse. And another thing you can do is you can do steps. So you can go straight down. Steps like that. Next this rail is far easier to get onto because it's going down, so and it's easier to grind on for this is like smoothed out and polished. And it is really low to the ground compared to the other one. And it's thinner rail, so it's way nicer. And yeah, so just I don't have much to say about these rails. They're pretty easy to make. Like, just go to freaking Rona or something. Buy like little thingamajigger like this for like a drawer, and then yeah, just that's that's really it.